Hello, hello, hello. So we're going to look at ETD, every tree different. Now this says revamped on the picture, doesn't really say that inside. Now this is a very big mod, 568 megabytes, let's just round it up. Um, it's very big, the pictures make it look interesting, whether or not it will be something we're really thrilled with, I have no idea. Um, it says it's compatible with some different things like the Great Forest of Whiterun, the Forest of Dabella, Simply Bigger Trees, etc. etc. It says this mod covers vanilla trees and will make them all different. Adding ultra quality look, it doesn't add any new trees physically. Now up above too it says that all trees are 4K. Most of them unique. So we're going to have to just go into the game and take a look at this. <clears throat> Pardon me. Now, the author's name is done with letters and numbers, you know, and I, and I don't know if they're trying to say Lester or something or what, but I don't really care. Uh, when you make your name something like that, then your name is that. Okay, I'm not even going to go into that. It's, it looks like Lester or something, but I don't know what. So I'm not trying to be mean. I just really don't know what it is. All right, so anyway, this has been featured, obviously, in PC Gamer and Vice Motherboard, I guess, or Motherboard Vice, well, whatever, anyway. So you can go look those up and see. Um, but nonetheless, I just thought, I have not looked at this mod. It's an older mod. It's really big, and I just thought we could take a look at it. Now, hopefully, our game will be able to handle it. Okay, I don't know. We will find out. I'm not using any other tree mod. Let me show you what I did. I went ahead and loaded it in where I usually put my tree mods up high. I just loaded it in there. I don't have any other tree affecting mods around it. So we'll see what it looks like. All right. All right. I will see you in the game in a moment. All right. Here we are out in the rift near Iverstead. And this is how every tree different makes the trees look out here. You'll notice some color difference from Tarshana's mod. Not bad, just different. You'll notice the trunks look different. I'm not sure. They look okay up close. Yeah, they look all right. Okay. So, you know, the trees look pretty good. Now, you know, this is still Skyrim and this is still a console, so... But overall, that looks pretty good. Let's walk back like we're going to go back to Iverstead, I think. Unless I'm going the wrong way, which I could be. Sometimes I just, I walk around so much I lose track. No, this is, uh, oh, no. Iverstead is that way. Ha! Huh. Anyway, it's okay. Nonetheless, you get the idea. You see these trees here. Let's walk just a little bit further. Now this is every tree different, and uh, they do look pretty good and pretty different. I'm not complaining. Perhaps we get uh, fewer trees with this mod than we did with Tarshana's mod, but there's a certain style to all of this, and it looks good. All right. Okay, so I'm going to take us up to Dragon Bridge. I think from there we can see what we want to see uh, pretty easily from there. Yeah, if you look here, I think uh, I think you can see some of those trees here, but I think we'll get a better look at them in uh, Dragon Bridge, okay? So I'm going to go do that, and I will see you in Dragon Bridge in a minute. Okay, so here we are in Dragon Bridge. Dark tidings and, doing and you can see the trees off in the distance, and you can see the trees here. I didn't check the time of day. Perhaps I should have. I don't know if it's late in the day. Let me see. Well, it is late in the day, but I think we'll... You know what? I'll just set us for noon. Hold on a second. Here, we'll just go to noon. There we go. That gives us normal lighting, so everything that we compare to is the same. So, this is every tree different still. We're looking at these trees, and we are seeing that most of the trees are different. Now, you know, there's only so much variation they had to work with, but... I would say they did a pretty good job. 
Now on the pine trees and everything, not quite sure if I'm seeing as much difference as with the uh, aspens, though the barks and stuff are different. You know, some are different from others. Now this was a very big mod, so it really, I mean, I'm not, try, not trying to be mean here. It really needs to do something outstanding to be worth that kind of space. Because right now, while I appreciate its differences and, and the way it does that, it's not outstanding enough to me to be worth that amount of space. Dude, you're kidding me, right? No, he's not kidding me. Hold on. Pardon me again. Here, we'll just... All right. Hand over your value. Don't you... There. We'll deal with him later. All right. So anyway, this uh, this looks good. I'm not putting it down. I am not. The only thing is, for that amount of space, I need I need to see something more. Now, and I'm not putting it down again. This looks pretty good, and it's it's nice that all the trunks look kind of unique, you know, and the bark kind of mixes some of that up, but I'm just not sure that it is, <laughs> we're getting some snow now, I'm just not sure that it's worth this kind of space, okay? So I'm going to show you the mod again, and uh, I mean really, I think the aspens and stuff look the best, but anyway, let me show you the mod again, then you can make up your own mind. Working. Alright, so this has been ETD. Every tree different, about 568 megabytes. While I really think the aspens and all of those trunks for them look really great, the pine trees look good, really good, but for this much space, I mean 568 megabytes, I, I can't justify it. It's not, it looks good, it looks better, and definitely the aspens look really great. But, I don't think it's enough. I don't think it's enough for me to do this when there's a lot um, smaller, lighter mods that will, you know, get me very, very close to this. Now, and it won't get me this, you know, this exactly, but it'll get me very close, at least I think, as far as an overall look and feel of the game. Now, you make your own decision. If you have that kind of space free... By all means, if you like this, and like I said, I really thought the aspens and stuff there looked really, really good. So, you know, it's just a thought. Um, I wanted to try it and just see what it looked like, but I don't think it's enough to get me to switch. Okay? All right. Thanks for watching. Hope you have a wonderful day, and I will catch you later. Alright now, move along. Nothing to see here.